Hi folks, today I thought I'd have a wee chat about a project that I am currently doing and that is to produce 31 Harry Potter covers in the month of July. So that's to publish one every day on social media um, this month. And these are Harry Potter covers. So they're books from within the Harry Potter series like Hogwarts A History and Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, books like that. And so I am currently at day, what day is it today? <laughs> I'm on day 11, yes. So I thought I would show you what I'm working on, um, where I'm at with this. And yeah, basically if you want to see the ongoing process of this and where I'm actually posting these final drawings, that's on my Instagram. I'm at Holly Dunn Design there. I will link that in the description. But let's go back to the beginning. So the first one I did was Hogwarts History, which is this one here. And these are all based on kind of classic book covers from sort of setting it between the, the late 1800s and early 1900s. Yeah, so that was kind of the golden age of illustration and I'll put some examples up on the screen so you get the kind of gist. The idea being that when these are eventually uh, digitized and, and made into, if they were made into books, they would be cloth bound. So on a colored cloth you would have one color printed on and then a foil color. Um, so I was designing these with this in mind. If you want to see my whole kind of list of objectives for doing this, then you can have a look on my blog post, which is down below. Um, but yeah, the idea here was that there would be gold foiling going on and um, this would be in a color. And then the second day was magical water plants of the Mediterranean. We've got standard book of spells and advanced potion making. Year with the Yeti by Gilderoy Lockhart. And there are a few Gilderoy Lockhart titles in here. So I have taken this kind of monogram that I've designed and I'm using that on each of them. Uh, we've got Defensive Magical Theory by Wilbert Sleekhart. Um, Unfogging the Future and Sonnets of a Sorcerer. A History of Magic and Voyages with Vampires and the one that I am currently working on so this isn't finished but if you want to see the finished product it will be up later on today. This is Quidditch Through the Ages by Kennelsworthy Wisp and can we just have a moment for how wonderful JK is at coming up with these authors names because they're just fantastic and there are many many more coming up in the rest of the month so if you want to see more of this like i said instagram is the place to go and if you want to read more about kind of why i'm doing this and why i think that a monthly challenge is a good idea then that's all on my blog i've got a list of, of all the the textbooks that i'm going to do but i have been switching it up a bit depending on um what I feel like doing that day. So I haven't got a definitive list of this is the one that I'm going to do on this day. Um, so that's a bit flexible. But um, yeah, if you're interested in that, then um, I'll link that in the description. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.